just wanted to say how much I missed you and us reading our stories together. So I thought I might read you one today. The new Pig the Pug called Pig the Monster. Hope you enjoy it. Pig the Monster by Aaron Blabley. Gee, I wonder what's going to happen with Pig the Pug this time. Let's read ahead and see. Pig was a pug and I'm sorry to say, on Halloween night, he'd get carried away. Hungrily drooling, he'd lurch through the streets, a monstrous rampage for treats, 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 treats. Treats, he would bellow, it's Frankenstein's pup. He'd grab a whole basket and snaffle it up. Treats, he would drool, a zombified bumpkin, and if you resisted, he'd up Turn your pumpkin. Yes, if you were stingy, well, Pig would be miffed and then he'd be vengeful and vengeance was swift. He'd egg your front door and an earling dragon. Then set about fixing your little red wagon. If Pig felt shortchanged and his hopes had been dented, it filled him with feelings that had to be vented. Terrible tricks would be briskly invented. Shenanigans like this could not be prevented. He ruined the evenings of those he tormented. The scale of his payback was unprecedented. He got satisfaction. He never relented. Your treats will be mine, he cried, wholly demented. Wild in his triumph, the mummy unhinged. He laid out his plunder and frantically binged. Tearing through candy, a glutinous goblin. He just didn't think about what he was goblin. Dogs can't eat chocolate, cried someone quite clever. Dogs choke on chocolate. He's no fool, that Trevor. Pig spluttered foully. Oh, wiener, don't nag. Then breathed in that chocolate and started to gag. Quick thinking Trevor, that wonderful hound, he snatched up Pig's ankles and swung him around. With a whoosh and a whirl, he windmilled that lug, a fast spinning dash hound, a chocolate filled pug. And soon enough, all that sugary gloop was loosened up nicely, a warm chocolate soup. Watch out! cried Trev, but the ground was dumbstruck as gallons of Halloween goo came unstuck. These days it's different, I'm happy to say. Pig's Halloween harvest, a modest buffet. He respects people's homes and he shares out his booty. His generous spirit, a thing of real beauty. He really is nicer and much kinder too. An old dog learned new tricks? Well, who'd have thought? Boo! What a crazy story that was. I hope you enjoyed it. Until I see you next time, stay safe, work hard and be good.